What's good, babes, and welcome back to our social media roundup. Let's talk about Megan Thee Stallion being back in court against her label 1501, claiming that they're sabotaging a new release of BTS's Butter remix this Friday. Now, you guys know there has been a lot of drama between Megan Thee Stallion and her label, but according to TMZ and court documents, Megan Thee Stallion is saying that she is the featured artist on a remix for the K-pop group BTS on their song Butter that should drop this Friday. Unfortunately, her label is saying that they do not believe in the song and Megan told the authorities and also her lawyers that she feels that this is just a way to sabotage her and block her from releasing music. Now, Megan Thee Stallion goes on to say that if released, Butter will help expand her international fan base. Thanks to BTS and their massive brand, she also claims that 1501 told her that, look, this is not good for your recording career. But Megan Megan again says that this is just a way to sabotage her and she is actually requesting that the judge sign off to block 1501. Now this actually happened before with her in 1501. If you guys don't remember, Megan Thee Stallion did take 1501 to court talking about her contract that she signed with the label back when she was only 20 years old. And just last year she did accuse the label of blocking her from releasing new music because she wanted to renegotiate her deal. She ended up actually actually getting an executive order from a judge to actually prohibit 1501 and Crawford from blocking the release of her new music. And she's saying that they are violating that order. So this is very interesting. If Carl Crawford does have an executive order that she should release music and that he cannot block that, then this could be in violation of the court documents. So as I was recording this video, I did get an update from Variety that they actually had a source in the courtroom who did verify that Megan the Stallion did prevail in her case against Crawford. Now this means that Megan Thee Stallion will be featured on the BTS Butter Remix this Friday. So let me know what you guys think about this topic down below. How do you feel about Megan Thee Stallion being on the Butter Remix this Friday? Also, do you think that BTS will help her expand her international brand? And also, what are your thoughts on Carl Crawford and 1501 trying to block her? Do you think it's sabotage? I look forward to reading your comments. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button give this video a big thumbs up stream super bass i love you guys to the moon and back and until next time stay messy bye babes